Hey everyone, today we're going to be doing this New Year's Eve, New Year's Day makeup look. Um, my New Year's Eve makeup look, this is what I'm going to be wearing. Um, and I just am I'm so obsessed with it. And this is my last video of 2018. Like, that's crazy to me. Oh, girl. Um, but yeah, so we're going to be making this look right here. Um, I really love how it turned out. Um, I really, really like it. It's so cute. That silver is just... Everything that I'm showing you guys in this video, I'm going to be doing on New Year's Eve morning. So, yeah. But I hope you guys have a great New Year's Eve um, and New Year's Day. Just be safe, be careful, because there's crazy people. And, yeah, there's, it's just, yeah. Don't do anything stupid, okay? That's just one thing I want to say. Um, but, yeah, so if you want to learn how to get my New Year's Eve or your New Year's Eve makeup look, then just keep on watching. Alrighty, guys, so I'm going to grab the Chart Tardies Pro Palette, and I'm going to grab this color right here. And I'm just going to have that as my transition for the other purples that we're going to be taking. And the brush that I'm taking is this Morphe M441 brush, I believe. And uh, it's just a really fluffy brush, and I'm just taking that and just really put that in the crease and blow it out. Then I'm going to go in with this Pro Fusion Pro Pigment Palette. Um, and I'm going to grab the color called Devoted, that one right there. I believe that's what it's called. And I'm just going to grab the same brush and just put that in the crease. This is just going to deepen up the crease and also bring purple into the eye a little bit more. Now you want to be careful with purple because purple and eyes, they it just doesn't go well because if you don't blend it very well then it'll just turn out like you have a purple eye and that's not really cute you know so you want to make sure you blend out everything very nicely um and yeah but i just took this purple that i just showed you guys and just wanted to bring purple back in the eye also i just really want this look to look um, like there's purple in it. I don't want it to look like there's just warm colors. I want actual purple. Um, and I just blend that out with the Morphe M441 brush. Um, and then I just take a white to highlight the brow bone. Um, but I feel like on camera when the makeup look is all done, you can't really see the purple, but IRL, you could totally see the purple. It's so visible, but the camera is not picking it up when the look is all together. Like, when you have lashes on and stuff like that. Just know that on camera, how it looks on camera is not how it looks IRL. It looks so much better IRL than on camera. Believe me. Um, so I just took this black from the Revolution palette, and I just put it on the outer part of the eye and blend that out. You want to make sure that this black is very blended because, like, you always want black blended, especially black, because if it's not blended, you could see where you placed it, and it's not its not a good look. Um, then I just cut my crease. The foundation that I use to cut my crease will be down below for you guys. Um, uh, but, yeah, um, I did not set it. I just went right in with a shimmer shadow, uh, more like a metallic. Um, I don't remember what this one's called, but I know it's from L'Oreal, the Infallible um, Collection. But I don't remember what the eyeshadow is called, but it'll be down below for you guys, as always. Everything will be down there. Um, like I said, I did not set um, the foundation. I just put this right on top, and it looked so cute. I think it would look totally different if I actually set the, con the foundation. Um, so I'm definitely going to be just applying the shimmer shadow or whatever I'm going to be using when I cut the crease, um, and not set it before I, like, apply it because it just looks so much better. It looks so cute. And I would say that it applied a lot better than actually setting the foundation or concealer or whatever you're going to be using to cut the crease. So I think it applied a lot better without setting it, so... And then I just took this Maybelline Line Stiletto Liner in Blackest Black, I believe. 
Um, and I'm just going to do a thin line on my lashes just to hide the band when we apply lashes later. And then I just am going to do my full face real quick. And I'm just going to take the same shadows that I took in the crease on the bottom lash line. Um, and uh, yeah, so not really a big deal down there. I just really smoke it out. Um, and Devoted from the Pro Fusion palette and the color from the Jominique palette, I believe. Is that the color? Yes, I just took those two colors together and blended it out. Um, so yeah. And then in a minute, I'm going to be um, smoking out the bottom lash line with black. And I already put black eyeliner down there, um, the NYX Double Eye Pencil. Um, and now I'm just taking the black to smoke it out even more. Yeah, in this clip I have black eyeliner on. So, yeah. Um, but I really, really love this look. This look is so cute. Oh my god. And I can't believe that this is going to be the last video of 2018 on my channel like that's so shocking to me but um yeah and then my lippy i don't remember the brand but i know it's like twisted kisses or something i don't i do not remember the color either but it'll be down below for you guys oh in my inner corner that will be down below for you guys also because i do not remember what it's called um as well as my lippy and my lippy is a matte lipstick but then i put a gloss on it all that stuff will be down below for you guys everything in this video will be down below for you guys if um, I didn't say anything or you missed something it'll be down below for you guys and yeah Alright guys, so I hope you guys like this makeup tutorial. I really love how this turned out. I am so wearing this so wearing this for New Year's Eve like I will no doubt about it. Um, it's so cute. Um, but yeah, so I hope you guys like this video and I hope you guys stay along, stay along, stick along with me um, for 2019. Oh my god, I can't believe I said that. 2019 is my first time saying 2019. Wow. But yeah, so I hope you guys have a awesome New Year's Eve. Also be safe because girl, be safe. Be safe, okay? always be safe but especially on new year's eve because there's just so many people it's just only one thing to say now um subscribe um for my first video of 2019 so if you guys want to see what my first video of 2019 is then you know stick around you know and i'll see you guys in that video Whew. bye